All right, so this past weekend, 7-Eleven did their Bring Your Own Cup Day. Yeah. Now, do you think they realized what this was going to be when they first started it? I think it's a fun marketing thing. I think they, uh-huh. should, they should lean into it more happily. They didn't realize what we were going to do with it. But sure. In general, it's fun. Yeah. I remember I the first year they did it, it was all kind of stuff that they had all over social media, and so they got a lot of social media attention. I'm yeah. just thinking if you're like the franchisee, if you're the if you're the guy who's the manager at the 7-Eleven right. on that day, and all the sea basses and the menaces <laughs> that are wandering <laughs> in, uh-huh. I will you say know, for the, for, with their different things they're trying to fill. For the most part, it is civilians, though. I saw, like, a family with a mixing bowl. I saw a dad who had, like, his tequila drinking cup. Nice. And, okay. the, the, the thing they posted on their Instagram, Menace, I think you saw this, was, like, a hockey helmet that they filled. Yeah. You yeah. know, it's, it's just, you know what it is? It's joining fun. It's, yeah. It's yeah. super yeah. fun. So the yeah. idea behind it is you can bring anything that's watertight yeah. and that is clean that's about, under 10 inches, though. That's the thing. You can't... Okay. You saw the first year they did it, they weren't really clear about the the rules. The people, uh-huh. right. people bring it in kayaks or whatever. Which <laughs> <laughs> is great. A hockey helmet is uh, clean. My son plays hockey. And it, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That thing stinks. Oh, drinking anything they, out. They, made a, yeah. they made to put a liner in there. So uh-huh. that's the idea. It's 10 inches or less, watertight, clean, and they will fill it for like a two bucks, essentially. Right. Uh-huh. And this year on Bring Your Own Cup Day for 7-Eleven, it was a very special edition. Oh. Because I, in this scenario, had just lost my mother. Oh, very sad. Just gotten back from the wow. crematorium. Wow. Oh, no. And just had her ashes in the morning. Oh, the nerd. Oh, look at that thing. Oh, wow. Yeah. That one looks legit. Oh, it is. It's, it's, it's I bought it off nerd. Amazon. It's yeah. a 10-inch. Uh, yeah. Wow. Black. You can see it's very fancy. Yeah. yeah. I like the way it's bedazzled. Yeah. It's yeah. Kind of like yeah. Shiny. So classy. Mm. Very nice. Would you put this on your mantle? Oh, Something you keep yeah. on the mantle. You know it. No, I wouldn't even put my dog's ashes on. Yeah. Oh, yes. Wow, Greg. So I walked in with the urn to pay respects <laughs> to my mother because she loves Slurpees. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> His mom doesn't. Right, what exactly. a lovely memory. She's all about Slurpees. And so I expected horror and revulsion. Well, that's not what I got. I walked mm. in uh, after this. This is a mother of, of her own with her own little kids, and they had brought their own little like kitchen utensils. They were having fun. It was a fun day. And she sees the urn, and she loves it. No, wait. wait look, what did he cry? Oh, yeah, it's my mom's ashes. Oh. <laughs> she- Oh, how sweet. Oh, oh babe. I what? Be, what the hell? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. babe. Maybe <laughs> it's because she's a mom. She had her kids uh-huh. with her. Yeah, sure. Look what he wow. brought. My yeah. mom's How <laughs> sweet. Jeez. Well, so, she did love Slurpees, you know? Uh-huh. Right, exactly. So she continues. <laughs> she uh, she just got him today, and she was a big Slurpee head. Look, no way. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah, she loved her. Oh, you guys got like a mixing bowl. That's fun. Yeah. This. I love one day, hopefully a long time from now, obviously, maybe your mom will be able to, a hundred years from now, obviously. Oh but uh, yeah, like, great. That's just, she yeah. loves Slurpees. Yeah, so we're going to top her off here. I, I just think that's awesome. Thank you. That is awesome. Yeah, that is just very sweet. Awesome. I don't think the kids got what I was saying. Yeah. Like, well, maybe one day your mom, who's here, you know, will be in here. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. The kids are like, what's going on? I like the follow-up. <laughs> <laughs> Follow-up question. So then, once you put the Slurpee mix in there, they just mix in with the ashes. Like, you just, like what if ants get mm. to it? You know. You know that's that's uh, nature. That's the mm. circle of life. Yeah. <laughs> the risky talk to the strangest kid about death. Yeah. No, <laughs> yeah. A, so hey, say your mom. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. She loves uh, blue raspberry and pina colada. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Uh, mm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the kids. It was. But again, very nice. So they loved it. Sure. Yeah. And uh, so I fill up the Slurpee. The, the the cashier loved it too. Walk up and uh, check out with my. An urn filled with ashes and Slurpee. Right. She loves Slurpees, Coca-Cola especially. Oh, yeah. Can I say a quick prayer for her? Do you, do you yeah. mind? <laughs> Mom, I hope you enjoy your last Slurpee ever. <laughs> Even though you are gone and leading us with a lesson that we shouldn't be making your own fireworks at home. It's just dangerous. <laughs> Hopefully this last bit of Slurpee will keep you refreshed as you meet Jesus. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> Thank you so much. Where's your mom? My mom? Yeah. She's in here. It's her ashes, yeah. <laughs> so she loves Slurpee, though. So okay. thank you so much. All right, take care. <laughs> uh, uh, have a great day. Goodbye. It apparently blew her so much. Yeah. Right. She was, the clerk wasn't getting it. She's like, wait, where's your mom? Wait, wait what? Oh, yeah. big fireworks um, accident. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Shouldn't make your own fireworks at home. No, huh? yeah, hey, so did she not, yeah. I guess, realize? <laughs> not at first. Like, yeah. until after you had already filled it with a Slurpee. Yeah. And said a prayer. Then I think it clicked. Yeah. It's like, wait, where's your, your mom? What? Wait, oh. what's happening? So what did she think was bef- what was going on before that? She just thought it was a cool vase or something. Oh, yeah. It's oh. vase shaped, I suppose. Sure. <laughs> but the, again, the mom, the other mom, <laughs> the mom picked up on it she immediately. Loved it. She loved it. All right. So uh, this next clerk. 
<laughs> that I met at 7-Eleven's Bring Your Own Slurpee Day. She knew exactly what this was when I walked right. in, even asked me, oh, is that an urn? <laughs> mm -hmm. I heard it's Bring Your Own Cup Day for the Slurpees. Is that an urn? An urn, yes. I just got my mom's ashes today, and she was a real big Slurpee lady. Uh -huh. So I know that before I put her away, I would like to get her some Slurpee, if that's okay. Yeah, it's the size. Thanks. I'll be right back. All right. Okay. How's no one stopping you? She said, yeah, that's the right size. It's the right size. Oh, it's the right I got size. no problem with this. But what about the whole part about cleanliness? Clean. Yeah. Well, clean. I, I, was, I was anticipating that. Like, oh, you can't have something filled with ashes. Right, exactly. Over, and my, my line would have been, which I didn't need to pull, would have been, oh, I've got them in a bag. Okay. And okay. so they're fine. Did, did you have anything in there at all? Nah, nah, nah. Oh, okay. So, uh, yeah, so it didn't even come up, which was great. Wow. Or you can just dump them on the counter. Like, oh, hold on. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, let me empty this first. Let me empty this here in the garbage. It's like yeah, cigarette yeah, butts here. Can I get some of those like uh, hot dog boats? Hold on. Yeah, that would yeah. be perfect. For your nachos? That would yeah. be perfect. Yeah. All right, so she's like, yeah, go for it. Right size. That's an urn. I don't care. Wow. Show back up. And again, lovely cashier to check out with her. She would have really liked this. Thank you. One ninety nine. All right. Do you mind if we say a little prayer for her? <laughs> uh, Mom, here's some Slurpee for you. I know it was your favorite, and I know you made some mistakes. No one should huff gasoline as much as you did, but <laughs> hope you enjoy this in heaven. Thank you so much. Have a great you day. Do I need a straw? You need a straw? No, no, my mom's ashes are in here, so I can't drink it. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you were like barely gonna go guess that. They're on the bottom, and then on top of that, Slurpee. Okay. Bye. Okay, cool. Bye. Oh, wow. <laughs> she didn't figure it either. She's Huff like, and gas. what the heck? <laughs> I need a straw. <laughs> well, I need a straw. We learned a valuable lesson about not making your own fireworks at home and also about huffing too yeah. much gas. Yeah. Yeah. Not and how nice not only the employees are, but the other customers. I know. Yeah. So Very kind. nice. So, so kind. kind. What does an urn run? This was, for, I think it's the classic funeral inflation you hear about with like caskets. Because yeah. this was, it's, you know, decent looking, although I, mean, yeah. I understand Oof. why Greg thinks it's, it's gross. It's black, by the way, black with silver. It's, it is kind of tacky. It's mm -hmm. like a... Uh, 80s nightclub urn. It does. This was like 60 bucks. <laughs> 60 bucks? Damn. Which is, you know, if he was just a vase, this would be yeah, 10. Yeah, exactly. Uh -huh. Isn't that what the county charges is for the cardboard box? <laughs> yeah. Probably. Like if there's nobody there, they're like, mm -hmm. oh, well. And yeah. this was on the way cheap side. Like, oh, wow. Yeah, yeah I was yeah. going to say, my dad's urn was like a couple hundred bucks. Yeah, because yeah, they know really. they can ch upcharge you. Right. Even bereavement, mm -hmm. whatever tax and all that garbage yeah just get a pot of get a plant get a, get a yeah. slurpee cup mm -hmm. who cares <laughs> so when uh we were talking about this in our planning meeting uh morgan was the first person to go like oh yeah i'll, I'll go do that too and then menace did one yeah right which we have and then guess of the three who forgot morgan oh, oh morgan. No. i just totally forgot oh. oh that's good you're a producer <laughs> Oh no! Because so, it is a fun bit. The, as you can hear, it's the easiest bit in the world to do. Oh yeah, right. sure. You just have to have something wacky, and, and you uh -huh. just have to remember. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, and you have to have two dollars. You have to have that, that, oh. a couple bucks. You have to have yeah. two dollars. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So uh, Seabass shared his adventures on Bring Your Own Cup Day. Very good, uh, good experience overall. With Seven Eleven, yeah, a lot less fight than you've gotten in the past. Everybody was so Pushback. sweet. Yeah, everybody yeah. was so nice. It was my mom and she passed. And, yeah, yeah, they don't want to be disrespectful. Exactly. Interesting how both <laughs> the cashiers at both stops didn't realize there were actually ashes in there, which there weren't, but like yeah. they didn't think there were any ashes in there until afterwards. Yeah. You would have thought like, okay, what's the rules of having to be like a clean sanitary, sanitary yeah, right. vessel? I'll at least ask. Can I check? Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. I didn't even check. Yeah. Oh, babes. All right, and so uh, Morgan forgot even go mm -hmm. and oh. try but uh menace yes went and, uh, he gave it a shot i did a planter box or yeah so i went to lowe's and i got a 25 gallon uh planter box which is, which is outside <laughs> no, the world. i'm which, sure that's bigger than 10 inches which looked like a a giant cup it cost 45 dollars for this planter box Jeez. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so I, how do they? What's the uh, what's the rule for the measurement? Well, at every one that I went to, every Seven Eleven mm -hmm. location, they have a little cardboard standout advertising "Bring Your Own Cup Day," and it's got a ten inch hole right next to the Slurpee machine. Uh -huh. The idea being, you yeah, put your cup in there. If it passes through the hole, go for it. Yeah. So I show up to this Seven Eleven, and there's none of that. And I don't think they even knew what was going on. Oh, <laughs> oh don't you love that? And so I just show up with this. Gigantic planner box. <laughs> Dude, we've been involved in a few promotions with the show. Like, oh, oh, yeah. You can go get your Woody Show sticker. They're available at all, whatever locations. Uh, and then listeners show up to get their sticker, and the people working there go, like, I don't know what you're talking uh, about. Yeah, what are you talking about? <laughs> what, what's the like, Woody meanwhile, Show? Meanwhile, their company is spending all this money to have this promotion and everything else. They don't even bother to tell <laughs> the people working at their stores. Yeah. What if your cup fits through the hole, but it's like 10 feet long? 
Well, that's that would okay. be that it would passes be, through, right? That would be kind of the workaround. And I was thinking about that, but there's nothing I can think of yeah. that is watertight, that is ten inches around, and then like three <laughs> feet long. Because like no kayak yeah. is and like forty feet long. Yeah, maybe like a okay, like we a have pipe? To be, like a yeah. long planter's box. So Menace is yeah. way off on this. He's got a yeah. huge planter, but because that's not watertight. Yeah. No. Oh no, it was watertight. It was a watertight put one. A pl- plug in the bottom or whatever, and. Oh, okay, yeah. so not on all sides, like a thermos would be. But that's no. not his problem. His problem is they don't know what the hell's going on. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they don't even know what's. Yeah, they don't even know what's happening. Yeah, so I show up to the place. What's that for? Bring your own cup day. That's not a cup. No, it's any cup. They put like helmets and stuff. <laughs> well. Yeah, if you look on the Instagram. <laughs> oh no, no. Uh, I'll wait. That's it? Yeah. No. 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 Check out the Instagram. No, I'm not going to no. do that. No. Not going to do it. Nah. Like, this is a big company wide promotion. I promise yeah. you. You've never heard of Bring Your Own Cup Day. How long have you worked here? Have you been on Earth more than five minutes? Right? Even no. if you don't work there, you know. Right. Even if, if someone walked in the radio station yeah. and said, Is it Bring Your Own Cup Day? I wouldn't say, uh, I have. Oh, what? I, what I, I, no. I would say, what? Hey, let me look that up. It wouldn't be, No. 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 Just no. Yeah. <laughs> And Menace is correct. On their Instagram, they had, like I said, a hockey helmet. So it's, yeah, it's not, because yeah. they, they say the word cup. And I ran into this last year, remember, like, well, that's not mm-hmm. a cup cup. I was like, no, they use the word cup as shorthand for anything yes, that can, because right. they can't just say any cup, any cowboy boot, yeah. any. Right. right. You know. They got to call it something. Right. So Menace goes through that, and uh, he tries to plead his case. It was just all over social media. Yeah, social media lies. So don't listen to what I was Social media lies. Yeah, okay. That's true. Broadly. Yeah, but yeah. it's on your social media. Yeah. It's on the 7-Eleven social media. It may not be on the social media for this location. Yeah. Which doesn't have one, obviously. What's on social media? Yeah. Social media lies. It was just all over social media. Yeah, social media lies. So don't listen to whatever social media yeah. says. At 7-Eleven, they lie? No, but we're not doing buckets like that, sir. Oh. Uh, That's ridiculous. <laughs> Okay. I'm sorry. What size can I bring? Uh, it's a cup Kool-Aid. I don't think that's right, though. Any cup you can bring in the You know how when you make Kool-Aid, you can't bring that in either? It's just a cup. There you go. Uh, okay? Okay. Well, do you want this? No. No, I don't want that. <laughs> no. She's Noah's her favorite. No She's fun. Wow. Yeah. She's she, really embracing the, second, the concept. The second I walked in with that planner box, before I even <laughs> said anything, she was... Get Very out. dismissive. I'll be honest. That would no. be my energy if I was working at a 7-Eleven. I enough. think not just on Bring Your Own Cup Day. I think pretty just much on every time. day. Yeah. Well, yeah. You could, you, Germans are known for being sticklers for the rules. <laughs> yes. And, you could, and you, they didn't know the rules. They didn't even know that was going on. But yeah. still, they knew this was wrong. Yeah. And yeah. I said, what happened to the planner? Is it gone? Oh, I returned it because it was 45 bucks. <laughs> 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 yeah. Never mind. Don't yeah. eat it. I ain't doing yeah. no yard work. Well, yeah. there's uh, Bring Your Own <laughs> Cup Day, everybody. Most yeah. success. Oh. Mm-hmm. Don't believe everything you hear on social media. Yeah, they're they just lie. all over social media. Yeah, social media lies. Yeah, they lie. <laughs>